you really shouldn't mumble. I did not expect that. And it's still wreaking havoc on our economy today. The American Rescue Plan is going to keep the commitment of two thousand dollars. Six hundred has already gone out. But if you're a two, if you're two, uh, uh, if you're a family that's a two uh, wage earner, right. so that folks don't go hung hungry. I think our Republican friends are going to support that. Maybe that's a little more than well. Yeah, they need the money. Just look at what leading economists across the nation have said, and in the world, and and across the and across the ocean have said. Oh my lord! Because they're still going to be have we're still going to have high unemployment, firefighters, nurses, folks are school teachers. My plan creates more jobs. Look, just this week, the Congressional Budget Office, and I want to say it very clearly on this. Be very clear in this point. Clear as shit. Getting dry, bogged down in a lengthy negotiation or compromising on a bill that's, that, that, that's up to the crisis. The biggest risk is not going too big if we go, if we go too small. The nonpartisan Brookings Institution has looked at the rescue, American Rescue Plan and said the GDP the, of, will reach pre-pandemic projections by 2021, meaning we'll have recovered by the end of 2021. Oh, oh, oh. We are so screwed. <laughs> <laughs>